Despite these hot spots are protected by shield generators, getting near them will be tricky. But you'll have So, what exactly is a hot spot? Basically a giant workstation. A system like the simulation you're in probably requires constant maintenance, which is what these seem to be for. Is this the only one? Of course not. Would you look at the size of that thing? Focus on the shield generators, otherwise you'll never get to the main console. Yeah! Ah, doesn't anyone learn? I guess I just pull these out. See who these hacking skills when brute strength works. at the base of the structure. Oh, sure. Shit now. <sighs> Done. Um, I'm showing some strange readings close to you. Okay, fiery sky and rain can be good. What the fuck is that thing? I don't know, but it isn't reading like a normal thing. I think I think you can integrate your code with it. And that means what? It means once you take him down, get close enough, and I think you can absorb him. Yeah, because I want that inside. Yes, bravo. Perhaps my wardens underestimated you. I won't let them make the same mistake twice. Uh, that can't be good. Forget about him, Kinsey. How about setting up one of those training rooms for- I think I can do that. So what did I get, huh? Teleportation? Laser vision? Bone claws? Please let it be bone claws. Whoa! Looks like the ability to freeze people and objects with an ice blast. That sounds awesome! Let me load up a few targets from the simulation for you. Hold on, hold on. Are you putting in people who will try to kill me? Don't worry, these are safe programs. You can't die from them. Good to be the president! This. It looks like data clusters can be hidden inside walls. Use your blast to knock them out. Oh, shit! Hell of an entrance there, guy. I'll see if I can help with that. Okay, you should be able to recover from being knocked back. Whoa. 
Hold on. It looks like Zuniac added the shield to the world. code. I guess he pissed him off. What else is new? So how do I get around it? You'll need something more powerful than a weapon. So use your superpowers to deactivate the shield for a short time. Then you can shoot him. See? That works pretty well. Though the real thing might be a bit tougher. Now this is a view!
make this one count! Kinsey right now. Where's the hospital? Whoa, hi! I? Got you now. I hate the landing! Driving this... Got you now! Let's make this one count! Make this one count! Try catching me now! I wonder... Why do I do this?
always relaxing. Time you surrender. Therapeutic. Yep, I'm satisfied. explosion totally freaks me out. your mind to get out of the simulation and back into your body. Head toward it. Got it. Fill me in, Kinsey. What do we know about the Zen invasion? The good news is they didn't get everybody. Just a whole bunch of people. According to what I've been able to decipher, the simulation is designed to house the best and the brightest specimens from various worlds. Best and brightest from an entire planet? How big is this thing? Big. But they haven't gotten to all of Earth yet. Just the major cities. Last I heard, Oleg was up at Camp David. That area doesn't look like it's been hit yet. Okay, so we got people left on Earth. Good to know. Once you're free from the simulation, I can sever your connection to the Zin Matrix. This will allow me to retrieve your body here in the real world without you suffering permanent brain damage. Where, where am I in the real world? Like, what are they doing to my body? It's in a safe place. Once you're free, I'll pick you up at the landing platform. Kenzie, door's locked. Wrong door. Oh, nicely done. Well, that didn't go terrible. Can you quit being a baby and just walk in? Look, lady, we're doing this in my time. No, you're not. <laughs> Give 
me that. In order to use this element, you will need to manually alter your power. Manually? Yes. I have created this tutorial message to explain how to do so. Oh, well that's handy. Now use your fire blast on those people. It will ignite anyone in the blast radius. I'm still standing! This would be great at a barbecue. exist in this simulation for various powers, if you are able to find or create the code that is. Thanks for the help. It is not help, only repaying my debt. Now I will let you continue on your quest to find me the body you promised.
Wait, was that it? So the AI won't help me break into other simulations unless he gets a body. So how do we get him one, Kenzie? The Zin have almost everything in the simulation locked tight, but there is something you can use. A control and interface device. Okay, great. Where do I find one? You're in luck. The Zin have a bunch in transit right now. using CIDs to bring a downed hotspot online. Once you have a... Go back to that first hotspot you took down. You can get a CID there. Simple smash and grab, huh? Sure. Go with that. Just get one and take it to a safe spot. You don't want to deal with Zin while trying to hack that device. I'm curious, is there any way to get this AI a body in the real world, too? At this point, the AI is purely information. He's entirely digital. You could download him to your phone if you wanted. Why? Does he want a body? Would you want to be stuck inside the simulation forever? Good point. I'll check the ship for a suitable shell, just in case. Along with the CIDs, Zen are transporting a prototype for a contained forced recursive feedback projector. Kenzie, that sounds like complete bullshit, even coming from you. <sighs> Imagine a gun that fires a bullet that bounces from one target to another to another to another like a pinball racking up a billion points. Oh. Just like Johnny Tommy. not to damage all the CIDs. I don't know when or if we'll get another chance to get one of these. Yeah, 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 Kinsey, I got this. Which CID should I grab? It doesn't matter. Just pick one. Ow! Shit! What did you do? I touched it. Well, touch it different next time. Oh, Kenzie! Don't pin this on me! These things are broken. Would you blow up on me? Yes! Finally. Quick, get to a safe spot so you can crack it open. How far away do I need to be? Just away from the Zin. Pick some place they won't find you. How long is this whole thing gonna take? I won't know until I crack open the device and see how it ticks. Alright, this spot looks good. Keep an eye out while I work on this. I guarantee the Zin have a way of finding these devices remotely. Shit, they found us. Don't let them take the CID! Work fast! <laughs> Don't worry, everyone loses to me.
Oh, hey! I found the tracking device. You done yet? Would you like to take over? I could shoot aliens for a while. Fair point. Kenzie, where are we at on this? Almost done. clear for uploading and putting the AI code now great how long until the upload is complete 55 minutes F 55 minutes these things usually take like three to five tops look the connection in this area is slow get closer to a major connection point like a power plant and this might go faster why didn't we go there first because a major connection point for the simulation is going to be heavily guarded we'll sit download faster well, probably but and we're taking this thing there So close. Once Sid's up and running, how long until we can use him to get my crew? Well, assuming the AI wasn't lying, I don't see a reason why we shouldn't be able to get right to it. Speaking of which, who do you want to grab first? Pierce? Jondi? I, uh, I think we should get Matt. Miller? Oh my god, why? Hey, Matt turned himself around after Steelport. Joined MI6, helped us with Cyrus Temple, and, you know, he's useful. Ish. Useful? You have a lot on your plate, Kinsey, with all this. Cyber, what's it? Figured you could use the help. I'm doing just fine without Matt Miller. Thank you. Two heads are better than one, Kinsey. Set it up. I'm here. I just need to clear these Zen out first. Flip the switch and done. Excellent. How long now? Uh, Ken Kenzie? That's just part of the process. Apparently the sweary part of the process. The full download should only take about 16 minutes. Is there anything you can do to make it go faster? I'll see what I can find. There might be additional access points we can use to increase the bandwidth. Personality transfer at 31%. I found an access point that can help speed this along. Get to it and activate it. Just like Johnny taught me. Found it.
and it's on. There's a second access point out further. Second one. All right, both the access points are online. How's the download looking? Much faster. Much, much too fast. Too fast. Sid is overloading. Overloading? Overheating. Get to him and cool him down. Okay, okay, we're good. We're fine. I managed to throttle the connection a bit, so it should be much more stable now. How long until the download's done? Three minutes. Good. Should give me just enough time to fight up a few waves of zen. Murder bots come from murder bot? Oh wow. Yeah, I'm having a bit of a stronger reaction. Sid, one of these murder bots instead. Do you really want to give some rogue AI an expert skeleton equipped with a complement of weapons and a history of violence? Probably not. Besides, I already found a real CID body for him on the ship. So, you know, synchronicity. Oh my god, why does this hurt so much? Personality transfer at 74%. Data bottleneck encountered. Better you than me! Download complete. Alright. Time to kill us some aliens. Oh god. I'm gonna regret getting Sid a real body, aren't I? Oh, Sid. We're gonna... This is great. Uh, Kenzie? Take him down and I should be able to transfer some of his powers to you.
Whoa, whoa, this is... Why is my brain on fire? Welcome to being able to move things with your mind. Giant glass orb here, Kenzie. Yeah. It has more clusters in it. Pick it up with your mind and smash it open. Now use that power to throw things at the warden and take down his shields. I'm sure you'll have plenty of chances to use it. Yeah. 